Hey, how's it going, YouTube? You know, with the past couple of months with the lottery fever, especially the big $1.5 million Powerball that was that just happened about a couple of weeks ago, it lets you know that if you ever hit that much money, or even a small increment of money, like a half million dollars, you definitely have to watch your back because friends and even family members concern against you. And we have an unfortunate story that's coming out of Georgia. Um, the man's name is Gregory Birch Jr., who, who is age 20. He was gunned down Thursday night at a home, at his home during a home invasion. Birch won $434,272,000 playing the Georgia's Fantasy 5 jackpot back in November of 2015. And one of his quotes before he died, tragically, he says, quote, my right eye and my hand just jumped for the past two weeks, Birch told the news outlet after he won. I knew that I would come I would come into money. Um the authorities said that Birch's girlfriend was home during the incident and ran for help. The officials could not immediately be reached for content be, but as of now they do not have any suspects in the case. Well, First off, I just want to say condolences to the Birch family. He was only age 20. And him coming across a lot of this money, not only was this a blessing for him, but sadly, it kind of made him a target. Now, like I just said, the authorities don't know who really did this. But that lets me know that someone must have known. Because when I put the link in the description box and you read the story, you know he has he got his picture taken with the lottery. Who you know with him winning this X amount of money, and it it just lets you know if you ever hit the lottery or just a big increment of money, you gotta be hush hush about that. Now I don't know if this was an inside job. I don't know if he, he had any enemies or whatnot. But it's at the end of the day, it's still tragic that. Someone who won the lottery and they died two months later after the incident. It's just, you got to be careful in this world, folks. And I hope swift justice comes and the family gets closure. I know it, it, it's sad, man, because with that money, I could do a lot of things with it. And you just have to be careful because they always say if you ever hit a big jackpot like that, you might just have to just cut family members and friends off to all together because people get jealous and they get jealous real fast. So you guys comment down below and let me know about this story. See you later everybody.